trading indicators. Hello everyone. Stock market indicators are tools used by technical analysts in order to determine the possible price movement of the stock in future. With these indicators, technical analysts can make decisions about when to enter or exit a trade in the market. So in this video, let us understand trading indicators in detail. Types of indicators Indicators are of two types, lagging and leading. Lagging indicators follow the price movement or change in trend already taking place. They are extremely helpful in confirming the change in trend. One of the most popular lagging indicator is moving average. And leading indicator usually signals the change in price in advance. Majority of them are called oscillators. They oscillate between a range indicating oversold or overbought conditions for stocks. One such popular leading indicator is Relative Strength Index or RSI. Let us understand this in detail. Relative Strength Index or RSI. Being a leading momentum indicator, RSI measures the rate at which the price movement changes of a particular stock. The RSI is calculated as 100 minus 100 divided by 1 plus RS where RS stands for average gain divided by average loss. RS is calculated for the look back period. Default time period is 14 period. Let us assume that the stock has moved upward for 8 and downward for 6 of these 14 days. The points gained and points lost will be divided by 14 to arrive at average gain and loss respectively. The value of RSI oscillates between the value of 0 and 100. RSI above 70 is considered as overbought and below 30 as oversold. Overbought position implies that the positive movement of the stock has peaked and there could be correction. And an oversold condition suggests that bearish momentum has hit the bottom and is ready for a possible upward movement. Let us understand this with an example. In this chart, the RSI is at the level of 70, suggesting that the stock is overbought and is followed by a quick downward correction. Here, the RSI is below 30, implying that the stock is oversold and sees a rebound. This level might be considered as a buy signal. These parameters of RSI for identifying oversold or overbought positions can differ for every trader. They can set these parameters according to their preference. RSI indicates the overall market sentiment of a stock, but it should be considered with caution. Use it with other chart patterns, indicators and overall context for double confirmation of any trend. So if you liked our video, like, share and subscribe to our channel. And for more such videos, visit our website www.edelwise.in. Thank you.